Hi YouTube and welcome back to another video. It's been a long time but I'm still here and I'm still crafting and I'm still doing everything that I do. So you know how we do it here. We get to the word of the Lord and then we get to the projects. So I don't have a project today. I have some hauls to show you today. I've made a lot of projects but I, I'll hold off on the projects for another day. So, um, I'm going to be reading out of my scripture writing plan that I did a couple of years ago. Um, so, this was my scripture writing plan that I did a few years ago. And um, this is like the page that I'm going to read to from today. So, it's Romans 7, 4 through 6. And it says, so this is the point. The law no longer holds you in its power because you died to its power when you died with Christ on the cross. And now you are united with the one who was raised from the dead. As a result, you um, produce good fruit. That is good deeds for God. When we were controlled by our old nature, sinful desires were at work within us. And the law aroused the evil desires that produce sinful desires, resulting in death. But now we have been release from the law for we died with Christ and we are no longer captive to its power now we can really serve God not in the old way but oh by obeying the letter of the law by but in the new way by the spirit and I took that out of the new living translation bible and that is Romans chapter 7 verses 4 through 6 and this was my decorative page. I put some washi tape. I had some metallic paints. And I had some little sticker flowers. And this is how I decorated my scripture writing for this was back in 828 of 2016. So I plan on um, starting a different scripture writing plan. Um, but I haven't decorated my book yet. I've been writing the scripture, but I'm going to rewrite them when I decorate another book. And I, I love, 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 love to write on graph paper. So these are just some of my other pages that I've decorated the book. I've painted, I've splattered, I've used stickers, I've used washi tape. I love scripture writing. So I plan to do it again, start back doing it again this year. But now let's get to the project. And here are some other little scripture writing plans that um, that I found in that book that um, I didn't do these ones, but I think I'm going to possibly do these this year. I started with something else, but I might um, do these ones. I'm not sure yet. But, so what I came to show you today is like lots of fabric that I've been getting from Hobby Lobby, from Joann's, from all over. So I'll start with these. These are some jelly rolls that I got from Hobby Lobby. They were originally $12.99, and then I saw them in the clearance section, and they were $5. And then I was like, eh, they're okay, but they're not pretty enough for me to pay $5 for. So this last time I went in there a couple of days ago, before the new year, they were... Um, three dollars so i paid three dollars for this 20 um 20 strips of jelly rolls and i ended up getting three of them so nine dollars for three things of jelly rolls that's pretty good <laughs> and then i also got this now a lot of this fabric i've gotten over probably the last couple of months but i'll just show you what i have i got this fabric this was a remnant but it's really pretty. But this was a remnant of fabric that I got. And I think I might, um, I know I'll make a bag, a small one or a big one. I'm not sure which one yet. Probably a big one. And then I also use this to probably mod podge to some, a, a wood piece and make some earrings with the Glowforge. And these ones I plan on, I mod podge them to some wood, but I didn't really like how they came out. So I'm going to march project them to a different type of wood and recut these on the glow forge. So I have this one. Um, we have this one. Uh, we have this one. 
and then we have this one so i'm going to mod podge them to a thinner piece of wood uh i think a 1 16th and then see how that comes off because the 1 8th i didn't really like the wood and how it came out so i'm going to make those into some earrings i also got this piece of fabric uh this came from joann's and i'm going to mod podge this to a piece of wood and then cut these out for some earrings because i think these will this will go really really good with some jeans this will go good with some jeans and then i also have this piece of remnant and i think this one came from hobby lobby um well I, it might have came from joann's i'm not sure it came from one of them hobby lobby or joann's this one the remnants at joann's all month long they've been 75 percent off and this one started out at 888 but if the fabric is on sale so if it, it said it was regularly 9.99 a yard so let's say it's seven dollars a yard so then they would take the discount half of seven dollars and then it will be half it will be 75 percent off of whatever that is so these were really good deals a lot of these i was finding i was paying a dollar or two dollars for this one says um 888 but um then it would have been 444 or the sale price but 75 percent off of that so I'm, I'm sure this one was as well and then i know this one came from hobby lobby and this was a remnant so i think i paid probably about a dollar or two for this because this a whole yard of this was on sale for three dollars and i think this will make some good jean earrings as well I know this one came from Hobby Lobby as well, and um, I think this is a yard, so this was probably $3 a yard. And then this was $3 a yard at uh, Hobby Lobby. This was, I don't think this one was $3 a yard. I think this one was like maybe 30 or 40% off, but I think this one came from Hobby Lobby as well. I think this one came from Hobby Lobby as well. And like these are three different kind of like three di three different little ones and i've gotten a um out of this no out of this one i think or maybe it's this one i made i have a bag over there that i made a big bag and a little bag and then i have this that i cut out a small bag um with and i'm going to use this piece to mod podge and make earrings I got this one at Joann's. I know that it because it was like a, a last chance fabric or something. And um, I bought, I think it's a yard or a yard and a half or either two yards. But I bought this to make earrings. And so I'll probably cut a piece off to make earrings. And then I'll also make a bag out of it. Um, I got this from... Joann, this from, yeah, this from Joann's, and it's flannel. And this one I'm going to uh, try to make some hats, maybe, or line some hats. Um, I think that's what I'm going to make with this one. And then I got this one, too. It's the same. These are the same. But they were 75% off. And then I got this out the remnants at Joann's, $6.99, but 75% off. I know this one came from Hobby. No, this came from Walmart. This is a Walmart fabric. And um, this is, I made a bag out of this. Uh, what does it say? It says, the joy of the Lord is my strength. And then the other pink word says, under his wings, you will find refuge. So that's what it says. Let's see. Yeah. Under his wings, you will find refuge. You can see that right there. My phone is ringing, so I'll be back. Part two. <laughs> 